I'm here in the university town of Oxford, England, walking down High Street. It's on this very site where in a house, Robert Boyle discovered Boyle's Law in the mid-1600s, relating pressure to volume. Boyle was born in Ireland in 1627. While a college student, Boyle traveled with a French private tutor. In 1641, they stayed in Florence, Italy, and studied the works of Galileo. Inspired to conduct scientific research, Boyle returned to England in 1644. By 1654, Boyle had settled in Oxford and was working in Cross Hall at University College, the location of which is marked by this plaque. It was here, with the help of Robert Hooke, that Boyle used an air pump to determine the inverse relationship between pressure and the volume of a gas. As the pressure on a gas decreases, its volume increases. If the volume of a gas is decreased, in other words compressed, its pressure increases. Boyle's law had been born. Robert Boyle would go on to conduct many other important studies in chemistry and physics, but none so famous as the law bearing his name, Boyle's Law. <laughs> 